How's it going guys? It's Amazed Animal Adventures and today we've got two very very beautiful black snakes that we're going to be taking a look at. So what I have here are two very common snakes in the eastern United States. We have the southern black racer and the black grass snake. Now most people, especially if they're not super herp prone, uh, just refer to these guys all as black snakes, right? They're all just black snakes. Which makes sense, they're, they're black and there's lots of black snakes, North Carolina and all that. But, you know, I like to be technical, so I'm gonna show you guys the difference between these two different species. So there are three basic differences I want to go over between your black rat snake and your black racer. First, let's talk about the scales and the skin. The, the rat snake is more chrome, more shiny, it kind of looks like it's been polished, if you know what I mean. And the right racer is, you know, a little bit more dull, a little bit darker, a little bit, a little bit more faded. It's like a faded black, if that makes any sense. The racer also has longer, uh, more diamond-shaped scales, whereas the rat snakes are a lot shorter, not, not quite as long as the racers. So the racers normally have that very uh, white, white chin and then a black underbelly. And this black also, we can see, is very, very faded and it's not a super sharp black. It's almost a grayish color. But in any case, they have the white chin and then the rest of their underbelly is normally all black or gray or whatever you want to call that. The rat snakes normally have a much larger portion of white underbelly, even though it does eventually turn into black. But it's normally not quite, not until quite a ways down the underbelly. We have the white chin and then a lot of white and then eventually it often goes back to black too. Also notice this sketchy checkerboard pattern on the bottom of the black rat snake. That's a very black rat snake-ish characteristic. Finally, uh, I want to talk about the heads. This is probably the best and most easiest way you can tell them apart. If you look on the head of the racer, you'll see a very, very dark eye, very ominous. They have a very, very uh, strong scale above their eye, which kind of makes them look mad all the time, you know, in our human personifying minds. Now the rat snake, of course, has a very, very lighter eye. It has the dark pupil, and then the iris around it is very much, much lighter, normally whitish or grayish. And then normally not so much strong of a scale on top of the eye. It makes the rat snake look a little bit more surprised, whereas the racer looks more angry. Also notice that the racer often has a very brownish nose, just like that slightly tinted brown nose, uh, where the rat snakes never have brown noses. Well guys, that's about it for this video. I really, really hope you found this helpful. Both of these snakes are beautiful, beautiful animals and were great sports for the filming of this video. And next time you see a black snake around, try to figure out what it is. And let me know how that goes down in the comments. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you next time on Amazing Animal Adventures.